turn my meter though. What's that? My meter. Uh, it's not charged. No, it's not. Okay, so think of the different oh, people. California. Alain. Alain? Yeah, it's like Alain. Okay. French. French? Oh. Yeah. People are ignorant. French? From uh, Is it still a battery? Canada. French Canada. Yes, yes. Quebec? Nice yeah. Good. Okay. Oh, there, there we go. go. Uh, Basel. It's okay. I'm going to finish. Okay, great. Oh. I think it works out. Oh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay, so we can ask you a question. You don't need to answer. Okay. And uh, this so needle. In my, in my what is yeah. it say? Okay. And this, this, this. You can preferably just put it on your lap. Okay. Like oh, it's just calibrated. And uh, this needle is going to move on the right. And I'm going to... So think at situation and uh, person in your life. Okay, okay, yeah. that's it. There? The, way so the needle's going to move needle regardless. Okay. okay. So what were you thinking about? My mom. Okay. So what's, uh, what's about your mom that's stressed you? Oh, Eso. Eso es stress. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is what I'm going to tell you. There are uh, particular reasons. Uh, personal issues. Okay. I'm sorry, personal issues. Ah, yeah? Okay. You and her? You can between you and her? Ah, okay. uh, no, my brother. What's about it? What's about it? Ah, you're going to be all right now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And how does that affect you? Uh, I'm just. Uh, I got it. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna ask you another question. Okay. 
think at another situation, think at other person or situation in your life. The, the needle's gonna move regardless of what you think. Okay. So it move a bit more. Would you think it's something particular? Actually, no. no. All right. So I'm gonna ask you a last question on in regard to the meter. Is um, think at uh, person and situation at work. He's just waiting for it to move. It's gonna move. Okay. So what were you thinking here? Uh, just my boss and what time did you uh, I work in finance, so it's really stressful. Uh, and, uh, I don't have to get everything done by a certain deadline. I got it. So in, 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 if I ask you, what is the thing you would like to improve in your life? What is the thing that's causing you the most trouble? Uh, money. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Lack of money? Yeah. I got graduated recently, so I don't need loans. So it kind of pays us off. I see. Okay. Now, on a personal matter, what is the thing that you think that should be improved the most? Uh, getting out more. Uh, because I'm trying to work so hard to make money. I don't have that much money. It's kind of more like work oriented. Yeah. Okay. So you don't have much relation, uh, relationship with others. You don't. No. Okay. Okay. All right. You can put the camera down. Do you know wow. about okay. this book? I do. You can okay. try to sell it here for twenty-five bucks. Okay. It's a relationship Scientology, it's about making money. Oh. It's written by a sci-fi writer named L. Ron Hubbard. And uh, you'll find time if you, if you go to uh, Ron if you go to ronthenut.org, you can learn about all about how crazy he was and how all this religion contains a lot of sci-fi nonsense in it. It's all about making what, money. What you think? So it's all about making money, which is what money, which is what sci-fi, which is what Scientology is all about. George, George, right? What's your name? What's your name? Are you gonna hide? I can't intimidate me, son. What's that? Can't intimidate me, son. Son, that's good. I like that. You don't look intimidated. I never can be. Good. Good. Yeah. So why don't you get lost? Yeah, I don't feel like it. I could tell. Yeah. So you just like to destroy things? You ever help? I like to destroy things which are bad for people. So why are you doing here? This is not it. Yeah, Scientology is bad for people. What do you know about it? You don't know anything about it. Tell me what the spirit is. Tell me what. They couldn't tell me what the spirit was. Do you know what a spirit is? Spirits. You know what a spirit is? Thetans. What's a thetan? Do you know what a spirit is? Tell me what a thetan is. You tell me what a spirit is. You tell me. I'm asking you. You know the first thing. I'm asking you. That's why I'm asking you what a spirit is. So what is a spirit? I'm asking you what it is. I'm asking you because you obviously don't know. Right, which is why why I'm asking you. Do you understand how that works? It's logical. If you don't know something, you ask someone who says they know what it is. Unless you're saying you don't know what a spirit is. If you don't know what a spirit is, then you can just say, I don't know what a spirit is. I have no idea. I'm sorry. But you don't know does what that, to say because you have no idea you? what you're talking about. Does that work for you? You're, you're not answering Psycho the question. Psychobabble, does that work for you? Are you oh, a psych? I was making sense. I was making pretty good sense Like there. what? What'd you make sense? Huh? Let's uh, careful. Don't get too close on it. Why not? Uh, you Dear. Yeah. You gonna hurt me? I have to. Go ahead. It's called the song. So Go ahead, hit me. Yeah. I'll wait till you touch me. Oh, God. It's going to be a stand up because yeah. I'm just waiting for you. Yeah, well, yeah. I'm sure you are. So, what are you doing? So, are you going to tell me what a spirit is? Else are you going to tell me what a spirit is? No. Are you going to tell me? I asked you what it is. I don't know what a spirit is. That's why I asked you what it is. You have no idea. Oh That's sad. God. You're That's so good. Sad. You're so good. So, you have no idea. The kind of things that L. Ron Hubbard wrote in your pathetic little Dianetics here. Wow, you're good. Do you know anything about Dianetics? Do you? Do you know anything about Dianetics? I know that you guys have someone out in the name of Zenu, a galactic warlord. What do you know about him? You've never heard of him. I know, I'm just, I wanted to get him on tape. You guys what do you know about him? You guys are oh. fucking idiots. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. Ignore him. He's okay. No, I'm telling you. Okay. 
Yeah, that's what I thought, son. I'll let you go, dear. That's right, son. Good try, though. If I was anybody else, I would have succumbed easily to that. If I was anybody else, I would have. But you see, I know what I'm talking about, and you don't. I'm not. I'm not sure. Uh -huh. No, no, uh, just to tell them all, uh, <laughs> Okay. That's it. All right. So, um, I'm uh -huh. not with them. Uh -huh. So, if you like them, you obviously don't have to listen to me, but... Oh, no. Uh, I honestly, <laughs> just like, each time, I, each time I see them, I'm like, what the hell is all this about? Yeah, this... So. Okay, let me tell you something. Got, you know who El, You said you know who Elvon yeah, was, right? He's kind of a crazy guy who wrote Scientology. If you actually go to Elron, if you go to, go to rondanut.org, you can learn all about his life and everything like that. But I'd rather just avoid him all together. What's that? I'd rather just avoid him all together. <laughs> it's all about making money, so you already know all about yeah. it. So you just did it for the fuck of it like I did. Basically. Oh. Yeah. Well, you have a lot more patience than I do. See, I kind of um, enjoy getting them riled up like they are right now. Uh -huh. They're like trying to take my picture, trying to make that guy try to intimidate me. It didn't work too well. Uh -huh. But uh, I just, me personally, I guess I have more of a critical stake in this than you do. And I just feel it tomorrow. Everyone has their own. Everyone has their own things in life that they're passionate about. You can be passionate about uh, whatever you're passionate about. I'm passionate about the one that shoots about the world we live in, so hopefully you don't think me strange for no. caring about it. No, on the contrary, you're probably the most normal person around me to watch right now. I follow <laughs> obviously no religion at all, uh, which puts me in the minority. I'm be surprised, I think. Oh, yeah? I think it's just the atheism to become the majority, slowly, for sure, at least. Well, yeah, I do, but it's, it's very slow. It's very slow. I just, it really upsets me. Did you see that they tried to intimidate me? Yeah, I was actually yeah. surprised. Did you see how this guy caught up on me? I was actually surprised by that. He came like, like, like an inch or anything. I'm like, this is what, you know what? California doesn't have the Florida has. Florida has the space wall, uh -huh. right? I didn't know that yet. No, Florida has a, has a, um, it's like a little bit of space around me where you know, someone's allowed to. Here in Canada, uh, Canada California, I don't even have that. So you definitely have to touch like a and a software in some way. And you see your In Florida, you wouldn't be able to leave. Oh, uh, okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. 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 Well, I always wanted to do it just for the fuck of it. What's that? I just always wanted to do it for the fuck of it. Uh, for French? Yeah. That's fucking good. My mom talks French, but uh, I don't know. I know like your. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, I, I'm going to France later this year, so I was like, yeah, why not? I always wanted to do this just for the fuck of it. Uh, I'm a huge Tool fan. I uh, what? Tool. I only know the Glock band. Yeah, I've heard of them. I don't really have them on my Spotify. Uh, but is it because I like Disturbed? Stuff uh, like that. Is it any relation to that? Because if it is, I'll look for it in Spotify. I'll do like all the same kind of genre. It's the same kind of thing. But yeah. I like, I, I listen to the top, like the most streamed music on, on Spotify, on Spotify. And they have a lot of disturbed and corn and stuff like that. So definitely um, check out Teal. I don't think they're on Spotify, but they'll definitely like two songs. Two of them, they just like talk shit on Elba Harbor um, for two songs. Have you seen the movie? No. I'm actually halfway through it right now. Uh, I just downloaded it. A friend of mine told me about it. It's, it's like, all about Scientology and the nature of the cover card and how much of a first it is. Well, for me, it's just like I can tell within the first five minutes. So, oh, so you have a good bullshit detector. Yeah. So okay. I'm just like, I'm not, I, I, you know, I already know that it's bullshit, so I'm not going to go in over okay. I just want to do it for the bug because I was walking by. I'm like, oh, why not? <laughs> But yeah, you like those, you like those two songs. Okay. They definitely talk shit on Elmer Hubbard. So I'll know them when I hear them. I don't need to There's literally a line called Paul Elmer Hubbard and Paul Elmer's Oh, so, okay. So, okay. Don't that line. Okay. All right, yeah, what's cool. your name? Uh, Edward. Edward. Sorry, nice to meet you. I'm walking by. Uh, if, so, if you... For the moment. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool. All right. All right, crazy guy. You got away with it today. Well, good luck to if you. Were, if you were in Florida, it would have been a different case. What's that? If you were in Florida, it would have been a different, different case. Okay, good. California, you can do that kind of thing. You can get away with it. Okay. Have a good day.
have the crazy Scientologist trying to threaten me. It's a Ted the Atheist. Uh, they're right up here in the corner. Uh, yesterday they were at... Uh, they were at... Um, uh, the, the mall, the Target mall up by Figaro. Uh, they had two desks there. And they have two desks here too. Uh, this is uh, Broadway and 7th, I think. And uh, I couldn't help it because they weren't the same people. So I had to, uh, I had to sit down and, and, and I made two video files. So I'm trying to put them together. Uh, as you guys know, I, I upload everything raw. Um, but uh, I hate fiddling with the uh, Sony Vegas because it's hard to, um, it's hard to, uh, to get down the kind of quality I want. Uh, so that's why I just upload everything raw. I could be like one of these fancy people and like Dusty Smith and edit my shit like crazy and become a fucking pro at Sony Vegas, whatever the hell he uses. I don't know. I just don't do it. So, um, I don't know. Um, if anyone wants to volunteer to cut my shit, you know, and give it back to me, uh, so I can upload it, that'd be great. But, uh, um, I guess it's only necessary if there's a lot of dead space that kind of sucks in my videos. But what I, I really try hard to to not have any dead space. I'm always talking, always trying to do something. Uh, there were the Scientologists. Uh, it was kind of a little boring there because I was just videotaping some people uh, doing their little fake readings and bullshit like that. So, uh, as you can see, they tried to intimidate me and uh, uh, shoot me away. But uh, uh, I'm not your average uh, American here. I can't be fooled. Uh, I can't be. Uh, I can't be bullied. And uh, so I'll upload this, and I hope you guys like it. Uh, please comment and uh, yeah, share my video. You know, I'm not trying to get to be the most famous person in the world. I'm just on the streets trying to expose the ignorance of religion. Uh, but um, I like to think I have a positive effect. Thanks. Have a good day.